addition between matrices works exactly like we expect it to. If I have the matrix 2, 3, negative 1, 0, 4, 2, and I'll call that A. So just to practice our dimensions, the dimensions of this matrix, it's two rows by three columns. So the dimension is two by three. If I want to add two matrices, they have to be exactly the same dimensions. So if I make another two by three matrix, um, let's go one, four, five, two, one, one. A plus B, the result is that I'm going to add each of the entries and put them in exactly the same spot. So um, this is a notation thing. This spot in my new matrix, and I'll pick a letter M, this spot in my matrix is the first row, first column. Again, we're always rows before columns whenever we're talking about matrices. This spot here is the first row, second column. Remember, because I'm doing addition, I needed to end up with the same dimensions. So it's gotta be a two by three. So this entry would be the first row, third column. Now I'll come through second row, first column, second row, second column, second row, third column. The way that I get the entries for this matrix when we're doing matrix addition, to get this piece right here for the first row, first column, I'm going to add the entries from our two matrices that are in the first row, first column. So two plus one, I get three. Now I'm looking for the first row, second column. So first row, second column entry, first row, second column entry, three plus four, I'm looking at seven. Kind of gonna hit fast forward here, erase all of these and just do the addition. So first row, third column, negative one plus five. Second row, first column, zero plus two. Second row, second column, four plus one. And finally, second row, third column, two plus one, and I get three. <laughs> 